Good afternoon, Plant the Seed. Um, here back with another video. Um, and today, I just want to, or should I say tonight, um, I want to encourage you guys um, to let you know that um, God is preparing you. God is preparing you for something good, something great. Um, I just want to let you guys know, um, just hold on to God's unchanging hand. Hold on, even when times are rough, when, you know, when the bills are due, the bills are late, when you're trying to find a way to, you know, make ends meet, just know that God is making a way. And I know sometimes we get impatient, but um, just be patient with God because um, he is the, the finisher of our faith and he wants what's best for us. Um, and sometimes we just have to hold on. Because, you know, God works in his own time. So, um, with that being said, um, I'm just letting you guys know to just be patient with God. Be patient with him. Don't be in so much of a hurry. Um, how I feel is like sometimes when I'm waiting for God to answer my prayers or to give me something that I'm asking for, um, I want it to happen like right away, like tomorrow or, you know, at that very moment. Um, but we have to understand that God's timing is not our timing. And in the in the timing process that we are waiting for God to answer our prayers, um, we must be patient and we must continue to pray, continue to pray and ask him for strength. Not only for strength, but ask him for for patience. You know, give Father God, I ask you for patience because a lot of us um, want things in a hurry. And sometimes, you know, like they say, um, when, once you plant the seed, um, you have to continue to water it. And what I mean by that is when you're when you're asking God for something, you have to continue to pray. Continue to fast and wait on God to answer your prayers. That's just like a flower. You know, once you plant that seed, it's not the flower is not going to grow overnight. You have to continue to, you know, water it so that it can grow. So what I'm saying to you guys today is um, have patience with God. Have patience with him because I know he's going to, you know, turn everything around. Um, and I know that he wants the best for you. So don't worry about what's going on. Um, just have patience. You know, God loves you. He loves me. He loves all of us. And he just wants us to have patience with him. Um, another thing, um, remember to always um, repent. Repent. Turn away from your sins. I'm going to continue to um press that you know i know i said in all my videos i'm gonna continue to let you guys know continue to repent and turn away from your sins and if you haven't um you know if you haven't turned away from your sins um it's time you know because you know god is waiting on you and like a lot of people say i'm waiting on god no god is waiting on you so turn away you know give your life to christ um at, you don't have to be perfect. You don't have to be perfect. Come to God like you are. Give your life to Christ and change your lifestyle. And just be patient with God because he wants what's best for you. Trust and believe me, he wants what's best for you. I believe God is, um, <laughs> he's a good God. <laughs> God is a good God. Trust me when I say that. The reason why I smile and is because I know God is so good. And I, how I know God is so good is because he's been good, you know, he's been good. He's been good um, all the time. And we have to just continue to have patience with him, you know, because God works in his time. And I believe that um, if we just continue to pray, continue to fast, continue to um, plant the seed, you know, just like my channel was um, called Plant the Seed and You Shall Receive. Continue to plant that seed. Continue to pray. You know, and I know a lot of people are out there struggling, you know, but just continue to have faith in God. You know, he will bring you through. You know, God knows none of us are perfect. He knows we're not perfect. 
but he wants us to do better. He wants to have a relationship with us. You know, we have to turn away from our, our sinful ways. You know, um, yesterday I was watching this, um, this, I believe it was a YouTube channel and it was a preacher and he was, you know, praying for a lot of individuals and, you know, a lot of people had so much in them that needed to come out. And what I mean, they had so much in them. Um, they had like a lot of demons, you know, trying to, trying to kill them, take them out. And see, that's why we need to stay close to our Heavenly Father. Because sometimes when, when we get into a spiritual warfare where um, we're being attacked um, and we don't know how to fight these demons off of us. Um, that's why we have to stay prayed up. That's why we have to stay in that word so we can know how to fight these demons off. You know, and I'm letting you guys know that um, I'm praying for you guys each and every day because a lot of people are walking around not knowing what they have in, in them. And sometimes we have to get closer with our Heavenly Father. Sometimes we need to push away the evilness. We need to push away that sinful thought, the sinful ways, because um, God is calling. He is calling His people. And we must answer. You know, it's time for each and every one of you that are watching this video. It's time that you turn from your evil ways. You know, God wants what's best for you. You know, Satan, he wants to kill, steal, and destroy you. You know, and as I was watching that um that YouTube video, you know, it got me thinking about how a lot of people are suffering. A lot of people are suffering and don't even know they're suffering. And, you know, the devil, he attacks in so many different ways. Um, he attacks in sin. He attacks in drinking. He attacks in smoking. He um, he attacks in sexual... He, he attacks in sex all... Anything that has to do with evil, the devil will attack you. And not only will he attack you through the evilness, but he will attack you through different people. And you have to be careful um, who you bring or who you hang around. Because, you know, spirits do um, flinger off on individuals. So that's why we have to be careful. That's why we have to continue to pray. That's why we have to continue to just give God the praise and stay connected in the word, you know, and start to repent um, from our sins. Turn away. You know, that's what I'm telling you guys. Turn away from your sins because God wants what's best for you, you know. So I'm going to leave it right there. You know, I love you guys. Jesus Christ loves you more. Um, let's close this video out in prayer. Heavenly Father, we come saying thank you. Thank you for the individuals that are watching this video. Heavenly Father, I ask right now that you cover your people, Father God. Father God, I ask right now that you take away anything, Father God, that is that is bothering them, Father God, that is that is distracting them, Father God, from getting closer to you, Father God. We ask right now that you deliver each and every individual that's watching this video, Father God. Touch them, Father God. Go see about them, Father God. I ask that they turn from their sinful ways. I ask right now that they repent, Father God, that they love you more. That they trust you, Father God. That they just know that you are, Father God, the, the beginning and the ending, Father God. The forever God, Father God. We ask right now that you just watch over their families. Touch their children, Father God. Father God, we ask right now that you lead them. That you guide them. That you protect them, Father God. Father God, we rebuke Satan right now in the name of Jesus, Father God. We claim victory right now. Father God, we ask right now that you just watch over us. Father God, each and every day, Father God. Father God, we ask right now that you heal the sick, Father God. You know what's going on, Father God. We ask right now that you cure them, Father God. Father God, anything that's going on, Father God, we ask right now that you just go see about them. We love you. We thank you, Father God, for what you're getting ready to do. We thank you for what you already have done. And we just ask that you just continue to keep your loving hands around us, Father God. Bless each and every individual that is watching this video, Father God. Show them the way, Father God. And we give you all the praise and all the glory. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen and thank God. I just want to say again, thank you guys for watching this video because God is going to bless you.
turn away from your sinful ways. Give it to God while you still have the chance. I love you guys. I can't say it. I can't say it enough. Um, but I love each and every one of you. I may not know you, but we are brothers and sisters in Christ. And I'm going to continue to pray for you guys. And I ask that you guys continue to pray for me. And we're going to win this battle. We're going to save souls. So until next time, you guys be blessed. And remember to plant the seed. Plant the seed and you shall receive God's blessing. Thank you guys for watching.